smelly fingers. If somebody offers an idea, well then tag the idea. And you let the idea develop. I really enjoyed the uh, DJ battle. Whenever Luke was lying on the floor, maybe in a bad breakdowns, I thought that was great. I really like the everybody sleeping, the puddle of people all sleeping and the alarm clock and stuff. They extract ideas from that, take that out, and uh, take the three ideas and then go away and develop them. And we still work within the world of improvisation and keep it as free as you possibly can. But as soon as you start sitting down with an idea structure, automatically comes into place. He starts off as plays by the word. Yeah. It's all plays. Like children. 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 Oh, it's pretty much the evolution of man is the, the idea of more. First we start off as rough caveman. Yeah. Uh, very posh the, uh, dinner, tea party, mm -hmm. very English. seen years ago was people on Chinese stilts also with stilts on their arms as well so it was like a four-legged thing and I was really infatuated with sort of the big tall thing on four legs more than two legs it's just weird it looks absolutely amazing so it would take place in a place in Guildhall Square several performers in smart suits clothes milling about Guildhall Square with a questionnaire asking people about their work-life balance. You might have other members of the company dressed up as students or homeless people or traffic wardens. We've got a huge clock, a huge alarm clock in the middle of the Guildhall Square that is just, just sits there and maybe it goes off. So an alarm goes off at a certain time and everybody who's involved, everybody runs together in that signal and does the break dancing. Anti-jesters, if anything, more Halloween's first thing. They're really dark, dark colours, like kind of red, black, kind of dark purples and stuff, with like a full mask, like a blank mask sort of, so it's like there wouldn't really be a nose to it or anything, it's just like a plain mask. It sort of bounce and devil, or the fawn sort of thing, the idea would be keeping you with the big fuzzy legs, big horns, Halloween make it more evil, for Christmas make it more blue and sparkly, you could do it differently for different seasons throughout the year, so the character be, you have the basic costume and then it's just easily adapted. Throughout, he's too strong, man. Basically, Cornelius and Tiberius, um, uh, one to the smite wise guy. Two kids, girly, very girly, with like blonde wigs, freckles, uh, big lollipops, and dressed like, like you know, Shirley Temple. When they stop, they meet someone like a family. They start to talk together, talk at the same time, and playing together. <laughs> 